Hello guys, welcome to Coding. The UB Ports Foundation has announced the availability of the first Ubuntu Touch OTA release based on the Ubuntu 20.04 LTS, Focal Fosser, Operating System Series. This release, known as Ubuntu Touch OTA 1 Focal, is surprising as it has been released ahead of the expected Ubuntu Touch OTA 25 update. The update is the result of over years hard work porting Ubuntu Touch from Ubuntu 16.04 to Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. The Focal Fosser Ubuntu Touch OTA 1 update is currently only available for a few devices including Fairphone 4, Google Pixel 3a, Wallaphone 22, Wallaphone X, and Wallaphone. UB ports also confirm that this release supports Android phones running Android 9 or later. The update includes the Lamiri UI, a fork of the Unity 8 mobile interface developed and maintained by UB ports, which is designed to make it available to other distributions than Ubuntu. Other notable features include the adaption of the system in its system, IATNA indicators, and WideRoid, a new porting style for device porters. Additionally, the update supports building many components against GCC 12 and QT 5.15 LTS, making it easier to port Ubuntu Touch to newer Ubuntu releases, such as Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. There are also bug fixes and improvements in the Ubuntu Touch OTA 1 focal release, including a fix for an issue when trying to mute the phone's microphone during phone calls, a fix for a context menu issue in the MOV browser, as well as fixes for various issues when receiving MMS messages. XValand integration has also been improved, and there is better support for running legacy X11 apps on Lemiri. The MOV browser received hardware-accelerated video decoding, and the camera app now supports barcode reading. The messaging app now allows users to zoom in on conversation text using a pinch and spread gesture, and the address book app now allows users to add notes for a contact and a URL address. The Ubuntu Touch OTA 1 focal release is now rolling out to supported devices, and users can update their installations by selecting the 20.04 stable channel under System Settings, Updates, Settings, Channels. UB Ports advises users to read the announcement page for all known issues. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching the video and please subscribe to our channel, feel free to use the comment box to suggest more topics to work on. See you next time.